baby sunshine goddess 33 how's your girl guys yes baby happy saturdays i think i got a saturdays siri from me to you so energy to energy if it resonate resonate hit that notification button down below so you're notified when i post my video okay maybe we need some light in here i can't really see you guys so the energy that i was picking up this morning there we go good morning guys the energy that i was picking up this morning is this you know i was i was really having a conversation with god and i was like god i don't like calling people karmic because i feel like i'm being judgmental so so who am i to judge who am i to say why i believe someone's karmic or you know what i'm saying unless they show me low vibrational activities unless they do low vibrational shit i really can't gauge whether they're karmic or not so so i was just really trying to come up with a word um for someone that's part of the journey so we're just going to call these people that are part of the journey um in relevancy your twin flame soulmate connection or your just relationship these people are starting to realize it's almost like they watch you and study you so much it's like they're like well i kind of would like fuck with them too you know what i'm saying they're realizing they're realizing that how much you and your divine feminine masculine energy are so much alike they're realizing i i could and literally pick up the energy of a karmic just literally watching divine feminine and literally falling in love with her personality literally falling in love with the person that she is not so much wanting to become her but wishing they had some of the qualities that she embodied so they're so so the person they're inquiring about or wanting to be with that you know would kind of look at them the way they do divine feminine but listen original is always worth more than a copy Okay, and I feel like this is my mask and I keep picking this up. I'm like, God, why do I keep picking this up? You know, they're really annoyed with the fact that these low vibra okay, low vibrational spirit just said say low vibrational. That they and I say low vibrational because when you don't live in your truth, you're in a lower vibration. This is driving me crazy. You you don't live in your truth, you're in a low vibration. So so we'll just say low vibrational because I don't want to say karmic because I just feel like I don't I don't know if these people are really karmic or not. Unless they do some karmic shit again. So I don't know. So so it's like this these low vibrational people know it's almost like they're starting to root for you and divine masculine. And they're like, you know what? If you really love someone, you know, you will want what's best for them even if it's not with you okay because unconditional love remember that comes with no conditions and they're starting to realize how it would be best if they stop trying to put up this fight and try to force divine masculine because i feel like a lot of these low vibrational energies entities are trying to force divine masculine to be with them force divine masculine and it's almost in a desperation energy you know what i'm saying and they know that their heart's not there you know what i'm saying they would sit around with these people it's almost like they can feel their mind wandering to a different place it's almost like like they can feel like yeah they may be physically sitting there with them but divine masculine's not feminine energy is not presently there with them okay so so that was just a little message to give you guys okay so we are the world planning had divine timing is at alignment this person knows if divine masculine hasn't told them or maybe they have told them like listen i this is someone a woman or a man that i want to be with in the long run and i plan on having a family with them and i plan on see your person possibly told them like listen i'm gonna go where my heart is desired okay and we are the world number 10 destiny this person it's almost like they've told them i'm leaving this relationship i'm leaving this connection because i'm gonna go where my heart desires okay and that's why they've been doing a lot of watching you on social media because they're really like this is where their true heart does that you know this is where their heart desires to be you know what i'm saying and and because if i must and hasn't made a conscious decision with this person you know they're realizing maybe it's time for me to go find my person okay because because they because spirit help me out because it is time so spirit say listen to these to the person because it, i have a lot of cross watchers on my channel um and i and i and i want to help them too i want to help them find their person you know they deserve love is just as well as divine feminine masculine energy but it's time for them to walk through new doors and have faith and relationships for people that are for them okay and and spirit is actually sending them people of their own okay the, but but spirit saying the time's not now because they feel like 
some of them have a lot of healing to do okay um somebody's coming forward to i can't believe i'm doing a reading like this somebody's coming forward to these low vibrations. okay i get it spirit so spirit saying no i'm not allowing these people to come in and ruin this connection but what i will be doing is sending them a love of their own okay so so i feel like this is a fair trade okay a win is a win baby a win is a win um and spirit saying like you got to find somebody else okay so so spirit clarify this we are the world and the gate is open because divine masculine femme energy they want to return to this connection and they want their happily ever after but you know they don't want the drama of these people that they dealt with in the past to kind of come in and ruin it so it's almost like divine masculine feminine energy saying listen i'm gonna go where my heart desires and it's like they're praying to god to send someone for this other person okay spirit clarify this cupid energy yeah look at the gates closed divine masculine feminine energy say listen it's not the right time for me i know where i want to be and it's not within this connection okay so energy to energy if it right so divine masculine is encouraging the, the low vibration their karmics to take a leap of faith and trust in yourself that you will find love because there's there's a love for everyone there's a person for everyone it's just not divine masculine from energy saying you're just not my person and i want you to go find someone where where you're happy where you're free where you want to be where you're not struggling to love where you're not trying to buy this love where you're not trying to get like divine masculine femme energies encouraging these karmics little vibration people to get out of desperation for them and find someone that you want to be with that's true and authentic to you because it's like they're kind of tired of watching this karmic struggle they're turned off from that okay they're turned off from watching them be in desperation because divine feminine masculine energy they sit and they wait they're patient while the karmic does everything to try to get divine masculine's attention uh calling obsessively texting them and they're just not in a divine energy and they don't it's turning them off to the point where they won't even want a friendship okay so spirit can you clarify this happily ever after return fix it grief they can't live and i i saw a reading yesterday and she kind of did the same thing they can't live in this energy of yearning for divine feminine anymore and the more this karmic person's in their face the more they don't want it okay and it's not that absent makes a heart grow fonder they just don't want it they just don't want it okay and you can't force someone to be in a relationship or connection with you okay understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it so thank you phone for clarifying so divine timing is alignment divine masculine wants to come in and sit down and communicate the past returns happily ever after the grief they're kind of tired of you know they're kind of tired of being mean to this low vibrational karmic person they're kind of tired of turning them down they're the obsessive energy that this karmic person has for divine masculine it's a turn off for them okay spirit clarified and and this person they're in denial they're like i acknowledge but i replace it with insight and awareness i acknowledge my fear and i replace it with insight awareness you can't lose what you never had how can you you can't lose what you never had and divine master saying listen this connection is closed it's not for me i don't want it but i do hope you go find love somewhere else and you know encouraging this karmic i feel like divine maskins caught this person watching your social media commenting on it you know maybe bringing up things you've done or said or bringing up you know if you have a platform social media maybe bringing up or saying things just like you where it's like they're starting to despise you okay they're starting to you know, I don't even feel like this is my mask and is even sexually attracted to this divide. You know, they just, to this low vibrational person, they just would rather be friends. Okay? They're saying, I would rather a friendship with you. I understand that a friend is in my life for a reason. And they're happy that you met you when they've got their divine lesson. But as far as sexual energy and wanting to be in a relationship, that's not something that they want. It's not. And they're realizing, you know what? I don't want to be with you. I don't and they're if they've said it and they came out and said it it's like this person they took that as playing hard to get but no they don't want this connection they don't want this relationship okay i can release my need to control you know this is my mask and they were dealing with this low vibrational energy entity because they can control them 
you you put your guard you put your guard down you put your foot down you say i'm not going to keep rewarding your inconsistent inconsistency with availability i see the comments you are doing that okay because i i read your comments and i try to work on your stories a little bit at a time but some of the comments that i pick up and that's how i know they're cross watchers you say your divine masculine blocked you but then the next week you're sending him money why he goes and uses that with another divine feminine energy okay so so spirit clarify this denial energy in social media doubt okay i release the need to know all the answers because they continuously watch your social media because they want to be like you so bad they want to know why is divine masculine they just want that divine love and you will get it but just not with this person okay because it's not your person Okay, and I feel like the cycle, it's almost like someone's like kind of like judgment free zone, but you're making yourself look like a psycho. You're making yourself look like you think these divine masculine femme energies don't know you're talking like they're divine feminine. I pick up the energy that somebody even tries to text or has text divine feminine masculine energy and pretended it was divine feminine, but they know our energy. They know how we talk. They know how it feels. They know that that wasn't them. So it's it's time to lay this to rest because I'm here to help you. Okay, Spirit, clarify this surrender and doubt energy for me, please. Trust. Trust in the divine that there is someone for you. Trust it. Okay, trust that. I accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly. I feel like this person, you know, I feel like Spirit's encouraging them to move on i feel like spirit said listen take that leap of faith move on with your life and move on from that relationship so you can have peace you deserve peace as well in your life but it won't be in pursuing a connection a relationship that's not for you so i had did that reading yesterday and one of my one of my um sunshine somebody from my sunshine goddess group you know she said you know i talked to her last night she's like no i didn't click and i didn't watch it because it would trigger me but come to find out that was for her you know what i'm saying the more i work with you guys and readings and energetically helping you move the energy around now i don't know what to call this what i'm doing but i can do a reading for someone uh for instance um i did a reading for someone you know she's like i can't my divine masculine hasn't been calling me late late at night kissed me in the morning guess what i woke up to a text message he's been calling her at night so I don't know, I'm working, I can work with energy, I just can't manipulate it. And I can help you become better at who you are so you can be better for yourself so you in turn can pull your person in. So guys, listen, I had my first relationship at like 16 years old. I've been here, done this. I was a housewife before I graduated high school. I know what to do, okay? I've had lots of experience. I've only been in three solid relationships my whole entire life. Yeah, I messed around, fucked around, whatever, but three solid relationships in my life, and I've grown. I've been in a relationship for 10 years. I have did a lot of growing. So, so with my insight and your insight together, we figure it out in, in the Holy Spirit, okay? Spirit, can I have the energy to clarify this? I can't do this. So Divine Masculine saying, listen, I'm throwing in the white flag. At least it's not a red flag. They're listen, fear and anxiety, you're interfering. The fear and anxiety you're displaying to me is interfering with my divine connection. It's like they're waving the white flag. There's 13, 45 o'clock. It's not that you're not a good person. It's not that, that you know, you have great qualities. It's just not. For them i can't even believe i'm doing i don't even know what to call this reading i love that centrist crew energy's energy if it resonate it resonates time to go separate ways so divine masculine feminine energy can go to their true love it's time okay surrendering doubt trust a temporary or permanent break is necessary this is my masculine saying listen it's necessary for me to go this is permanent okay this is it's time to go separate ways period okay spirit one more for this little vibrational person you're you're insecure you're insecure to the point where you're settling for less than you deserve. It's turning divine feminine masculine off, okay? Struggling with limiting thoughts and feelings because they're in denial about thinking this could, it's not your kingdom ordained spouse spirit. Spirit said just spirit. Spirit said just say that, okay? And thoughts and memories are constantly cycling in their mind. Have the faith to let go of this connection and have the fresh start that you desire, okay? Spirit's calling for you to have more self-love. 
more self-love when it comes to yourself so your self-love to my low vibrational karmic person your self-love that you're seeking and i know you're upset because you wanted that relationship connection something's turned domestic see what i'm saying i'm, I'm not going any more further than this seek the peace that you want within yourself so you can find your person okay i love guys sunshine's crew energy to energy resonate keep your head up in her close god because there is love for everyone love is patient love is kind it's just that it's not these divine counterparts i love guys sunshine's crew energy to energy resonate and i'll catch you guys keep right up in her close god and i'll catch you guys on my midday mix and we're next week whatever comes first Mwah.